Eight on your side, Ryan Hughes. Talk to a Bay Area attorney who knows how to handle all that money. Ryan's live for us at the Sitco in Tampa. And Ryan, Walt Leonard represented one of the biggest lotto winners in history, and I love this story. Exactly. You re may remember the 20-year-old from Pasco County who won that huge jackpot at the beginning of the year. Now his attorney has some advice for the person who wins all of that. When it comes to dealing with an enormous lottery jackpot, this man knows a thing or two. Tell as few people as you can get away with, and if it is a huge, gigantic number like that, hide, leave, get out of town. That's right. The winner of the whopping $521 million Mega Millions jackpot shouldn't spend a second celebrating. It really comes down to security and safety and privacy for you and your family. Walt Blenner represented Shane Missler of Port Ritchie when he won $451 million bucks a couple of months ago. Before the ticket was cashed in, they got some affairs in order. You have to line up your team, your financial experts, your tax lawyer. Blenner tells us he, Missler, and family members got in a private jet seen here and headed to Tallahassee. They were met on the tarmac by armed officers from the Florida Lottery who drove them to claim all that money. Shane was just ecstatic. It was just a great time for him. He's a great kid. Uh, he believes that the good things come to people who do good things. Blenner still takes several calls and emails a week from people asking for a cut or hoping Missler will help them start a company even though he no longer represents him. Missler is spending time with family and traveling, often posting on social media. We're told he recently attended the Super Bowl in Minneapolis, where he apparently stayed in a budget motel. And perhaps some things never change. This is my ticket for tonight's drawing. I certainly hope this is the lucky one. We're told if somebody chooses the cash option, they will walk away, Jen, with 317 million dollars not too shabby oh boy i can't i mean i would love to I even know. try to imagine that now i understand there is a pretty cool story with shane about where he kept that winning ticket exactly his attorney tells us he was reading a book called the secret so he tucked the ticket into the book and he actually clutched the book as they flew to Tallahassee. Oh, the secret. I wonder if he manifested that uh, winning lotto situation. <laughs> we'll have to ask him if you we ever get the wonder. chance. Ryan Hughes, live yeah. in Tampa for us. Thank you.